Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Me, so hope you guys are doing good. So we're gonna do a reading on um why do aliens abduct people and first we're gonna see if they abduct people and then we'll go from there. So as always, uh I'm not sure what we're gonna get, so yeah, let's get started. <laughs> If you guys are interested in any of these decks, link for them is down below. I'm gonna start off with tarot and then move into oracle cards. So first we're gonna ask, do aliens abduct people? Do aliens abduct people? I'm talking about like UFOs, like gray aliens. Okay, so do aliens abduct people? We have King of Swords in reverse. I just heard you don't get us, so. Okay. Do aliens. Knight of Cups. Aliens abduct. We have Page of Swords. Do aliens abduct people? Natural resources reversed. News in reverse. Hopefully you guys can see these. I'm not gonna take those. Okay, we have terrorists in space. So right away I'm definitely seeing that there's a communication barrier. <laughs> With the King of Swords in reverse. It's like, hey, we want to talk to you. We want to offer you this. But then we're the Page of Swords. Like, we don't understand it. We're defensive. And we're scared. Okay, so let me keep looking into this. Do aliens abduct people? If they're coming back, yeah, they want to talk. Moving. Why? Okay, why am I picking up that? They try to get in contact with people that are kind of closed-minded. <laughs> okay, we have glow up in reverse. Sad over an X. Need to plan slash organize. Parents having kids. Yeah, okay, so what I'm picking up is that they're, okay, I'm going to explain it and then I'll get into the question, so, actually, let me pull, okay, sorry, <laughs> let me pull, like, two more cards on King of Swords. Weird, there's, like, a little mat right now. Okay, we have... New World Order in Reverse. Underage and Cult. Yeah, so, okay, when they visit humans, humans, like, freak the fuck out. They don't understand what they're saying. They don't understand what they want. They think that they have bad intentions. They just like freak out and these aliens are trying to like offer them something good. And I feel like this is higher knowledge. Okay, so they communicate telepathically. Um, I also kind of pick up, I don't know why, but when I'm talking, I'm hearing like a clicking noise. So I could make 
clicking noises or like <laughs> yeah there's like what would you say this is like frequencies different frequencies to communicate so they don't like open their mouth and be like hey <laughs> they use telepathic communication which if you know any animals animals use telepathic communication like you can like with your dog you can sense what they're usually wanting and that's same with aliens but aliens have higher knowledge so their intelligence is like humans but more advanced um So I feel like the aliens feel like they don't, the humans don't get them right away because they don't speak the same language even though they do. It's just like the humans are closed-minded. So then they have to come back and like try and communicate again. I feel like they keep doing this multiple times. There's also an energy of like they take, the aliens take the humans to a different location too to kind of show them what they're about. And sometimes they still don't get it or like they're still scared so there's definitely this emphasis on like you don't really understand what we're trying to do you don't really get us <laughs> so they do abduct people I ask do they do experiments on people can you MK Ultra? We have murder, Illuminati, ancestors. Okay, so I also wouldn't be surprised if there are humans that they abduct um, that have health issues and then they go in and they, they could literally like fix whatever health issue they have. Like let's say someone gets abducted and they have a broken leg well, they get abducted and they come back and their leg would be perfectly fine. Like, whatever they're doing to them, it's like they're helping the humans. They're not doing it because they're trying to harm them or anything. <laughs> spiritual downloads already coming in yeah they feel like fear just takes over a lot of th these people though let me ask like what kind of people they choose or why okay, we have hierophant Justice. Eight of Pentacles, the Sun card. <coughs> Blood sacrifice in reverse. Child trafficking. Yeah, we also have the parent and kid card over here too. Physical abuse in reverse. Yeah, so they're abducting people to help them. It's not because they're trying to hurt them. And I don't feel like the humans know that. The humans are just very fearful. They feel like they're going to hurt them, but they're not looking to hurt them at all. They're in fact looking to help them, looking to take care of them. So if you guys hear about like how aliens like will abduct someone and then come back and revisit them over and over again, 
it's because they're like checking up on us it's kind of giving me like um with these cards like checking up on their kids making sure they're okay kind of energy Like they ultimately want us to be good. They want us to be doing well. Physical abuse in reverse. Like they're trying to let us know that they're not like wanting to hurt us. But like we don't understand their language or we just don't understand them. Yeah, there's something about like disease, health, so they could tend to target people. Well, I wouldn't say target, they tend to help people with like diseases or health issues because they don't use drugs. They don't use stuff that's like toxic to us. I also feel like they could be aware of things that happen before it happens with us too. So if you, let's say an alien abducts you and they, I don't know, they put something, like they, I don't know, they put something on you. Um, it's because they knew like you were going to have like a disease or something was gonna happen to you in the future if they didn't do that. Also hearing you could have a bond with them. Yeah, like you'll see signs of them. This could be before or after they visit you. Or both. <laughs> we have sacrifice. Yeah, okay, alcohol. I feel like some people black out or don't remember things because of the heightened fear. And sometimes they make sure that you don't remember things because, like, it would just impact how you live in a negative way and they don't want that for you so I don't know this is kind of giving me like a doctor or a parent taking their kid to the doctor and then sacrifice is telling me like these aliens would do anything to like help you Anything else? Yeah, I keep seeing this card symbolism. Addictions are reversed, so they could help people with addictions. It's mainly people that could like die or something really negative could happen to them if the aliens didn't interact oh yeah okay i was just gonna say because they have a higher calling so they're meant to like be here for a longer time or be healthy i have blockage i don't like how people view them as really like negative like they're trying to hurt them yeah because they have like the energy of like a puppy like like it's innocent it's not like i want to <laughs> i want to tear you apart and kill you it's like i want to make sure you're okay because you're like my best friend <laughs> Need to rest in reverse.
And I'm also hearing um, hypnotize. So they have like some cool telepathic abilities that they can make you sleep. So again, it's all just to help. They also feel like some people say things about them just for money, for clouts, or like to get attention to make them look bad. They have masculine. Now ultimately they're looking just to help. So that's what I'm seeing for the reading. Let me know what you guys think and I'll talk to you later. Bye.